Hey everyone, for today's video, we'll be taking a look at yet another budget Intel B660 motherboard, MSI's Pro B660MA Wi-Fi DDR4. Now, I've already done overviews of ASUS's and Gigabyte's budget B660 Micro ATX motherboard offerings, so let's gun for the holy trinity by giving MSI's offering a once-over. For the uninformed, this board sports the mid-range Intel B660 chipset, which offers support for, you heard it right, Intel's upcoming 13th generation Raptor Lake processors with a BIOS update. Of course, this board also sports support for the current 12th generation Alder Lake processors as well. As the model name implies, this board offers DDR4 support, which should help to lower the cost of building a PC with this motherboard. Let's get started. The Pro B660MA Wi-Fi DDR4 belongs to the budget-oriented Pro series of motherboards by MSI, which is touted to be more business-oriented, placing beneath the MEG, MPG and MAG series of consumer-oriented motherboards. This motherboard therefore comes in a box with a rather unassuming aesthetic. Moving over to the rear of the box, we get the usual overview of specs for this board. We'll walk through the board specs in depth in the next few minutes of this video. Setting aside the board for the moment, we see that the Pro B660MA Wi-Fi DDR4 comes with two SATA 3 cables. We also get a pack of M2 drive screws and standoffs, what MSI calls a M2 locker which I presume allows one to replace the standard screw and standoff for the second M2 slot on the board for a toolless M2 drive installation experience. Apart from this, we also get an I.O. shield right here, a pair of Wi-Fi antennae, a nice metal case badge, a DVD driver disc, a thank you card, as well as a quick installation guide. A pretty decent set of accessories I must say. With that, onto the board itself. And here we have it, the Pro B660MA Wi-Fi DDR4. MSI has gone for a light grey on black colour scheme, with these motifs that make for a rather busy looking aesthetic. As can be seen, the board does not come with an integrated IO shield design, nor does it come with built-in RGB LEDs of any sort, though of course, there are onboard RGB headers. Moving over to the rear of the board, we see that MSI has included what it calls anti-collision circular prints around the mounting holes of the motherboard, which apparently protect the PCB from scratches during installation. Now it's great that MSI's included VRM heat sinks, which as you can see, are pretty sizable, especially when compared to competitor B660 motherboards from other brands. This definitely helps with the board's performance where the folks over at TechSpot did an extensive test covering the performance of various budget B660 motherboards and the MSI Pro B660MA Wi-Fi DDR4 came out on top in terms of performance against the competition where it could handle even the demands of the top of the range Intel Core i9-12900K processor. Moving on, the heatsink for the B660 chipset is a passively cooled affair and MSI has also included a heatsink for the primary M2 drive slot. For memory support, the Pro B660MA Wi-Fi DDR4 comes with 4 DDR4 slots with support for up to 128GB of RAM and the DDR4-4800 standard when overclocked, with plastic slots of a single tab design. Right next to the RAM slots is a set of easy debug LEDs that can help with troubleshooting PC issues when posting. Further down is a USB 3.2 Gen 1 Type-C front panel header and beneath it, a USB 3.2 Gen 1 front panel header which supports up to two USB 3.2 Gen 1 Type-A ports. This is courtesy of an Asmedia ASM1074 chip that MSI has included with this board. While still on the topic of USB connectivity, the bottom edge of the board houses two USB 2.0 front panel headers with each header providing support for two 
USB 2.0 Type-A ports. Near the USB 2.0 front panel headers, we get a Thunderbolt add-on card header, which is to be used in conjunction with an add-on card that is sold separately by MSI. The said card adds Thunderbolt and additional DisplayPort connectors for your PC. In terms of expansion slots, this board comes with a single PCIe 4.0 x16 slot with the steel armor feature which reinforces the slot especially when a heavy graphics card is installed. We also do get a PCIe 3.0 x1 slot and a full-length PCIe 3.0 x4 slot. In the storage department, MSI has included four SATA 3 ports with two in a right-angled configuration and two in a straight-angled configuration. For M2 slots, it comes with dual PCIe 4.0 x4 M2 slots of which one of them comes with a heatsink. For audio, MSI has gone with a Realtek ALC897 audio codec, which is commonly found in most mid to lower end motherboards. Wired internet connectivity is courtesy of Realtek's RTL8125BG chip, which provides support for 2.5 gigabit Ethernet that is fast becoming a common feature even for budget motherboards of today. For wireless connectivity, the Pro B660MA Wi-Fi DDR4 comes with built-in Intel Wi-Fi 6 with Bluetooth 5.2 support and this is courtesy of Intel's AX201 wireless module which comes pre-installed in the M2 Key E slot that is located right here. In the cooling and RGB departments, the board comes with four fan headers which are located in these regions of the board. Also included are dual addressable RGB headers and a single 12 volt RGB header located right here. Moving over to the rear I.O., the Pro B660MA Wi-Fi DDR4 goes for a traditional I.O. layout without an integrated I.O. shield design. The board comes with a PS2 port, two USB 2.0 Type-A ports, dual DisplayPort 1.4 ports and dual HDMI 2.1 ports. Do note that these four display output ports support up to the 4K 60Hz display standard. We also get two USB 3.2 Gen 1 Type-A ports, a 2.5 Gigabit Ethernet port, two USB 3.2 Gen 2 Type-A ports, Wi-Fi and 10A connectors, as well as your standard audio jack connectors. One thing to note though is that MSI has gone for a non-standard CMOS battery arrangement as can be seen here, which is going to make CMOS battery replacement in the future more challenging than it needs to be. In conclusion, MSI's entry-level B660 board is a solid pick, owing to its future-proofness with support for Intel's upcoming 13th generation Raptor Lake processors. You also get a solid power delivery solution which gives the Pro B660MA Wi-Fi DDR4 top marks when it comes to performance against other budget B660 motherboard offerings. Further helping its case is modern features such as PCIe 4.0 support and 2.5 Gigabit LAN as standard. One thing that I do not like about this board however is the CMOS battery arrangement which makes future battery replacement a hassle. As of September 2022, the Pro B660MA Wi-Fi DDR4 can be had for a price of around 240-ish Singapore dollars through retailers at Simlim Square or for you international folks, approximately 149 US dollars on e-commerce platforms such as Newegg. With that, thank you so much for watching, hit the like button and get subscribed if you've enjoyed this video and I'll catch you guys around the next time.